Greetings guys and girls and fellow gamers, my name is games for kicks and welcome back to Anthem. In the last episode we had a look at some of the side missions, the contracts that we were able to get and that was pretty fun and we also gathered some resources to unlock our vanity store here. We're gonna continue with the mission today, we don't really have any other side missions anyway but the alliance system is over here with some challenges which are passive so I thought we actually have to do them but they're, they're well we do them while we do other missions and over here then we have the ancient missions or which are the contracts contracts that pop up every now and then. So we're going to be able to do them as well, which is great for resources, extra experience and bonus points and all that stuff. Anyway, we're going to continue with the main mission. As I said, I hope you guys are going to have a good time with the episode. If you do, remember to kick that like button in the balls to support the channel. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. So let's get started. All right, we're going to team up with the randoms again, which actually seems to work really well. So we have incursion as our mission. We have to rescue somebody from a regulator camp. Let's enjoy the scenery. I always love this. I'm gonna leave this in all the um, episodes, pretty much, the flying, because I think it's really, really awesome looking. So what's the latest intel these days on regulators? Still the same smugglers they've always been. Anything of value is fair game, plus the usual rumors of secret hideouts in the area. They have to keep all that stuff somewhere. Hmm. Question is, why would the Dominion be involved? I hope Tessa's wrong about that. I'm not looking forward to being a wartime cipher. There we go, we have to go into here, is it? Excellent. Okay, you're not far from the regulator camp, should be coming up soon. Keep an eye out. We're oh, nice, we have some resources territory. here. Lovely. Jeez, they're well hidden within trouble. the mountains. The camp's been overrun. I'm clearing them out. Okay, coming. Nearly there. There we go now. There we go, nice. Looks like you got dead regulators there. Oh, and can you identify Tassin's agent? Uh, it's some ammo, very see, good. You could still be alive. I don't think animals killed these people. Is there anything useful at the site? Let's see, there's a marker. Okay, there we go. No, 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 there's something here. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's some kind of recording there. Dominion have attacked the camp. I can't reach Tuss. We're looking for the regulator hideout at these coordinates. Okay. That was Tassin's agent. Oh, I'll need to decrypt the coordinates and hang on, Scar's on the move. Ah, uh, no. Oh, my balls. Okay, here we go. There we go. Nice. Here we go. Excellent. Here's more. Oh, here comes these guys. Okay, let's do it. Come on, I'm taking the heat, guys. So you guys, you get them from behind. Okay, let's get some. Oh. Nice. Okay, let's deal with these guys. Nice. Owen, do you have those coordinates? Yeah, got it. It's not far. Then I'm going to the hideout now. We can't wait. Is there any health? Any heals left? Are you sure about this? Take oh, we're healing up. Nice. This is like fighting a pack of wolven. When evil people knock on your door, you don't hide. You kick their ass back to whatever hole they crawled out of. <sighs> Stop the fire before it spreads. Fort Tarsus cannot become another Freemark. Okay, where do we have to go here? Regulators outside the cave. Maybe they were defending their hideout. I guess Dominion don't take prisoners. Okay, 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 we're overheating. Oh wow, look at this. 
Okay, what happened? Did we get kicked out? I guess Dominion all right, we're back. Friends. The server crashed. So we all got kicked out. Please tell me the server hasn't crashed again. I literally only just got back to where we started. Good, good. I was worried there for a second that everything crashed again. A smuggler's cave, it would seem. Anything you can want, for a price. Looks like that includes shaker relics. Ooh, look at that, we got some resources here, very nice. They don't seem to have much variety. Oh, Everything is chimeric alloys. And yeah, chimeric this. That. You're in some kind of field. Has to be affecting your suit. the problem. There's a Dominion shield generator that's suppressing flight capability. Could explain how they ambush the Reckoners. Can you disable it? Well, I've never dealt with one before. It would take time to override. Best to press on. Flight control's back. I'm pushing on. The Dominion can't be here by accident. These smugglers are hiding relics. I know. I'm trying not to jump to conclusions. Oh, I will. Take a flying leap. Because the wrong Shaker relic in the wrong hands. This won't be a boring day. <laughs> Certainly won't. Oh, nice. Cool down. Love it. I love my suit. And there we are. The Dominion. Yeah, and they've got Tassin's agents. Best lie low. Give us the relic. We know it's here. I, I don't know what you mean. Then I'll show you. No. Look at the That's size of him. We conduct business. I find the pain is no substitute for money. So let's negotiate. The relics not for sale. <laughs> See, progress. You do have it. Now name your price and we all walk away with something. Relics are dangerous. Only if you're careless. Do I look careless? Officer, we found the relic. A pity for you. Negotiations have concluded. Ah, oh, man. You bastard. Oh, yes, okay. I've taken it on my on my own. I'm pretty sure that the other guys see this. Well, yeah, From their perspective. Liquid? A freelancer. How oh, useless. I fought your kind before, and I put them in the ground. You'll be joining them. Ah, balls. And now we get down to business. Let's do it. Are we really in a firefight with Dominion? Yes, Fire. we are. You're sitting in a chair somewhere. Not used to having professional soldiers shoot at us. Scars, maybe, but not like this. Well, let's work on both of them. I didn't say it wasn't exciting. Just be careful. Clear. You did it. But what about Tassin's agent? She's still alive. I don't think so. She didn't make it. There's no. an archive here. I see it. There's damage from the fight. Maybe Tassin can make sense of it. This can't be for nothing. What about the one they call the monitor? He took the relic. Then I'm getting it back. Okay, where are we gonna go? There we go. Let's get it back. These were classic Dominion tactics. Total carnage and no witnesses. What are they doing this far south? I don't know, but it involves relics. That won't end well. Let's go. Let's get this guy. Sorry if I'm... Oh, boss. Sorry if I'm quite a lot. It's like focusing on the flying and listening to the narrative. That's trouble. Push them back. Okay, no problem. Watch it. Looks like the monitor left a cleanup crew behind. Ah, boss. Try to disable that machine. I have the specs. I think I can override it. Hold here. I'll 
I'll try to deactivate it. Great place to die, Owen. I have let you down. We have hey, to get wait. up here. You're getting too far away. Where are they coming from? Here we go. There they are. Nice. Is there any more left? There's over. Oh, there is. There we go. Nice. And there we go. Pretty serious looking too. Watch yourself. Freelancer, you can die a meaningless death or surrender to us now. We'll spare you the agony. Ah, don't worry about it. I'm actually pretty happy where I am. And here we go. The last of them. I can still catch the monitor. Better hurry, he's got a head start. So let's go. There we go. Oh, yeah, got some resources here. Thank you. Always have time for resources. So this is getting interesting. Oh, look at that, a hidden location. Okay, we're outside. There we go, nice. There you go, you can't be too far. Dominion must have big plans for a guy like the monitors in our neighborhood. We just need to make sure he never comes back. You see, this is why I want to be out there with you. Show bad people the door. Not as easy as it looks. Okay, show bad people the door at the end of a very large gun. Okay, we're nearly there, I think. Oh, it's raining a bit, which is nice. It keeps the suit cool. And into the mountain. Okay, you're coming up at him. Just ahead. Checking. Is it just me? Or does it look like the Dominion is staying a while? I don't know what they're up to, but it's not happening in our neck of the woods. I suppose they listen to recent. Talk it out. Does this look like they dropped by for tea? Oh! Hey, watch it! Another one of the monitor's lieutenants. There we go, his arm, his shield is down. Go, go, go. Okay, it's over. Small one for the freelancers. Okay, I keep my special for... Oh, what is happening? Yes. Congratulations on walking straight into my trap. Owen? Owen, what's happening? I don't know. Okay. Obviously more powerful than you. The I monitor. It's important to take a measure of one's adversary. And I find you lacking. Yeah? Ask your lieutenants how they feel. Oh, right. You can't. Because eh? I put them down. <laughs> Freelancers boast of courage they never have. It's why they're extinct. I'm alive and well, you son of a... Okay, what's happening? He's gone. Save your breath. You best head back to the fort. I'll let Tassa know we need to talk. Okay, that's it. Wow.
wow okay that was intense i'm very confused the mission ended we got like this is very confusing the mission ended and um, we ended up in the launch bay. A quick tour of the launch bay is available. Make sure to familiarize yourself with this space. You can use access to send messages to other players. I don't want to send messages to other players. The launch bay provides easy access to a forge for freelancers to customize the javelin. Okay. How is it? Why is this different now? Um, here are most of the kiosks you would find in Fort Tatras, including the Alliance system contract. Okay. Is that Fort Tatras that has changed now? Launch Bay Featured Store and Expedition Bay. Below you can access appearance options for your javelin at the feet. So it, it, this must be Tatras or whatever. It just says changed. Okay, we're going to continue. I'm going to speak with Tarson. Okay, so this is the door. What is it called? The Launch Bay. So we still have the features here. Okay, that's interesting. All right, so to continue the mission, we have to talk to... Our guy over here and on the way we're going to talk to a couple of characters so let's do this this is the part that i really like i like the kind of story parts of if it this isn't my favorite freelancer i hear you've been busy i try you pulled rice arse out of the fire yara was here doing a reenactment <laughs> i had a good feeling about you ever since you turned up keep proving me right okay all right fort's home gotta look out for it no argument here it's good you settled in not everyone does and I'm guessing Fort Tarsus wasn't in your plans before. Well, the Heart of Rage. I didn't know what would happen then, or where I'd land after. Turns out it was here. Happy you stuck around? Yeah, I like it. Yeah. I'm not sure what I expected, but this place grows on you. I wasn't meant to be here myself. I was on a strider out of Heliost. Supposed to end up in Antium. What happened? Cataclysm. The sky turned yellow, ground changed under us. The survivors were brought here. You never got to Antium? Didn't have the means to try again at the time, and now I got good work, had a kid. The fort's home. Glad you feel the same. When you're here, anyway. Which reminds me, I should run checking your javelin before you're off again. Thanks, so. though. Yeah, that would I'll be great. So we learned more about her as well. She has a kid. Very good. And now let's go over to our friends. I really wish we could run here and make this whole thing a little bit faster. <laughs> Let's see what the bot is all hey, about. You're a freelancer, right? I've heard things about you. What kind of things? Some of the arcanists said you stopped a cataclysm. Or a giant Ursix? Or both? That was me, yeah. It was kind of both. Interesting. You're one to watch. I don't want to say too much just yet, but be mindful. A lot of eyes will be on you soon. What does that mean? It means this is the time to show what you're made of. Okay. If you've got a contract for me, I'm happy to hear it. Not a contract, exactly. Have you ever heard of the Path to Glory? It's like a ranking of Lancers, right? That's not all it is. There are certain rewards offered to those on the Path. Rewards offered by who, exactly? The Emperor. Put yourself on the Path, Freelancer. What you do will matter, I promise. It's all fine until someone gets electrocuted. <laughs> okay. Take it easy. Nobody's gonna die. Thank you. For what? For stepping close so you don't impede foot traffic. You were off to the side, so it seemed to make sense. My apologies. I assumed you would recognize me from one of my public safety forums. Sorry, <coughs> I was not aware those were happening. My name is Perndal Blatch, and I'm the Fort Custodian. I maintain and improve all public works and spaces. Sounds like a big job. It's enormous. <laughs> I'm seeking public input on an initiative to improve life in Fort Tarsus. Would you care to take part? Oh, why not? I might. Excellent. Please answer the following questions. Do you A, believe the fort needs immediate improvements to function more efficiently, or B, recognize the fort has glaring inefficiencies that must be corrected? Aren't those statements both the same? No. One suggests immediate action, and the other identifies issues, then proposes solutions. I'm not sure the fort wants to change. The fort must change. It's unsafe in so many ways. Take the walking issue, for example. Did you say walking? Yes. People walk and stop wherever they please. This causes stoppages, bumping, and even pedestrian rage. I'm proposing we implement lanes and foot traffic rules of way. People will hate. residents will never buy into it. I disagree. People said we didn't need the fountain, but now I'm spearheading the campaign to restore it. How does a fountain make the fort more efficient? 
The fountain creates a meeting place and instills pride in the community. Happy people are more productive. Is the fountain working? Not at the moment. There's a piping issue. It was nice chatting with you. I'm off to a meeting regarding proper personal equipment in the forge area. Good luck with that. Thank you. It's not easy keeping this fort safe. Yes, because lanes and foot traffic is exactly what we need to keep um, the Dominion away from us, I think. So I don't think there's anybody else to talk to. Oh, there is. There's a few places, a few people. Oh, my balls. Okay. Anyway, guys, I'm going to do the talking here with these guys. Um, I'm going to leave that in the outro, though. We're going to do an outro for a change. And if you're interested in it, just continue watching. Otherwise, I hope you guys had a good time with the episode. If you did, remember to kick that like button in the balls. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Until then, as always, viel Spaß and happy gaming. Man, with something like that, you should really soak it. Hey, freelancer. Hey. I can't believe I'm talking to you. You're like the most badass freelancer in Fort Tarsus. <laughs> My name's Neeson. Hello. Hey, aren't you teamed up with that cypher, Owen? Yeah, why? Yeah, no reason. I just thought you might be concerned about that cypher school thing of his. Okay. What are you talking about? Okay, all right, maybe I shouldn't be telling you this, but I heard he got over-altered during his training. Over-altered? Yeah, I guess it glitched them up pretty bad. What are you talking about? Oh, I can't say for sure, but that's what people are saying. And you gotta admit, Owen is a little goofy. No, he's not. Yeah, no, I don't think so either. I'm just <laughs> telling you what I heard. Thanks, but that kind of information isn't useful. Yeah, I get it. You already knew. But if you ever need any info on anyone else in the fort, I'm pretty plugged in. Yeah, no thanks. No need to close that door. I, let's just agree to maybe meeting in the future. Or let's not. Yeah. I got you. Catch you later. All right. You you must be the 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 famous newspaper that just spreads rumors and talks crap all day. <laughs> so let's see where we're off to next. Um, okay, we have a couple of more guys here. There we go. Oh yes, there's our man. Look at I'm that. A freelancer. What can Matthias Errol Sumner help you with today? I just wanted to see how you were doing. My research is progressing. I'm still alive and very happy about it. I intended to buy you a drink as thanks for the rescue, but then I remember being banned from the bar. Uh, you're banned? Why? For, uh, starting fights. I'm not proud of it, it just happened. One minute someone's mocking Von Blatt's theory of diurnal obsolescence, the next minute you got bloody knuckles. You know how it is. Yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, I know what you mean. Emotions take over. Exactly. Sometimes old impulses take over. Old impulses? Growing up in the streets of Helios, you pick up some bad habits. Discourse, dialogue, civility, the Arcanist ways, those I had to learn. Lashing out is instinct. I didn't know you grew up on the streets. I don't advertise it. Everyone has a past. It's what you do now that matters. That's what I kept saying. I wanted to learn. I wanted to improve the world through knowledge. Still do. But it wasn't enough for some. They couldn't overlook my origins. Yet you persisted. I had to. I had to force open the doors they shut on me. Force open the door. The gateway, if the aperture could be widened and maintained. Oh, you're brilliant. But I didn't. Apologies. I meant me. I must pursue the strain of thought. Talk later. All right, we're down here at the bar, talking to Max. Well, I know you. You're the hot shot who silenced that shaper thing, yeah? Word travels fast. I keep an ear to the ground. Best way to stay alive out here. Maxine. Call me Max. Welcome to my bar. You're the owner? Am now. Got it off Dusty in a game of cards. Pretty sure he threw that hand. <laughs> you really think he'd bet his entire bar and throw the hand? In a heartbeat. If he ever had a heart to begin with. Dusty managed to lose the deed to his bar and his shirt and the very next morning headed out of town. Only he didn't make it. Hold up a second. What happened to the last owner? He was on a strider to Antium with the governor and it went down. Some say accident, some say a hit. Nobody made it back and the black box went missing. You think Dusty was the target? Or the governor? Dusty owed a lot to the wrong people, but dead men don't pay their debts. The governor? Not really worth the trouble, you know what I mean? Dusty's not the only owner to die in glitch circumstances, just the latest. People think this place is cursed. You don't strike me as waiting around for certain doom. Who has time for that crap? <laughs> I'm a 
Deals don't make themselves. You're doing good work around here, freelancer. I'll get you a tab. First one's on the house. And if there's something you need, maybe I know some people. We'll see, okay? Sounds like a plan. Thanks for the chat. I think we have to talk to Leeson, Neeson, Neeson, Liam Neeson. You see, that's the problem. Um, we have to talk to Neeson again. What do you All think right, let's check this out. Hey, good to see you. You're a freelancer, right? I think you knew that. I never assume. Like, I'm a laundry man now, right? But not very long ago, I was a cleaning guy. I figured you were like me, always on the move. We're not that alike. Sure we are. Anyway, <laughs> you know Yarrow, right? That super old freelancer? Sure, I know Yarrow. You think you know him, but did you hear about him in the Tesselar? Oh, I should have listened to this. No, but I have a feeling you're going to tell me. Yes. So, I guess a long time ago, he was guarding some families, and a kid got too close to a Tesselar burrow. It all happened so fast that to save the child's life, Yarrow had no choice but to choke the Tesselar to death with his bare hands. But Tesselars emit an electrical charge. Yarrow would have at least been knocked out. Yeah, but I guess he held on, even though he was unconscious. Why wasn't he in his javelin? I think it was really hot out. Javelins compensate for temperatures. Uh, you know, you reckon this story, no. right? <laughs> I was just trying to understand how he did it. Trust me, he did it, okay? That's why he talks so funny. He does? Uh, yeah. Have you ever talked to him? Yes. <laughs> you have? I tried to once, but he was, uh, he was too busy. Hey, do you have time for lunch? I don't think so. Yeah, I mean, we're both so busy, huh? That's hell. All right, I'll see you around. <laughs> what is this guy? But you see, talking to these guys actually gives us points, yeah? So, uh, in a way, you want to do it, but they really have to make traversing faster because this place gets bigger and bigger, and traversing at the current speed is just very slow and painful. 